Hi, question number seven. Given that the integral of ln x over x squared dx is equal to two fifths with limits from one to a, show that a is equal to five over three times one plus ln a. And for the second part, we need to use the iteration formula based on the equation a is equal to five third um, one times one plus ln a to find the value of a correct to two decimal places. Use an initial value of 4 and give the result of each iteration to four decimal places. Okay. So for the first part we have this. And we need to prove that a can be written as 5 over 3 into 1 plus ln a. We're going to be integrating this. So this is basically the integral of ln x times 1 over x squared dx. Now we can see that this is integration by part by parts so we're going to be using late where we have the integra integral of u dv is equal to uv minus the integral of v du good so the logarithmic uh, fraction comes first therefore we have here ln x so i'm going to say u is equal to ln x therefore du is equal to 1 over x similarly 1 over x squared is the same as 1 x to the power minus 2 Right, and if we have to integrate this, it's going to become minus 1 over x. And now we're going to be doing u, and this is going to be uh, dv, all right, and this is going to be v, all right. So u dv, all right, sorry, so this is going to be v uh, dv, okay, uv, all right, uv minus v, v du, u. So ln x times minus 1 over x is going to become minus ln x times 1 over x minus the integral of um, v du. v is minus 1 over x times 1 over x. So minus 1 over x times 1 over x dx. So we have minus 1 over x ln x minus minus becomes plus we got the integral of 1 over x squared dx. Okay, so this is my minus ln x over x plus... Um, we have to integrate this plus the integral of x to the power minus 2 dx. So we have uh, ln x over x. You integrate this, you're going to get minus... Uh, minus 1 over x yeah because you add 1 to the power and it becomes minus 1 and you divide by the new power you're going to get minus 1 over x all right so the denominator are the same therefore we have ln x minus 1 over x now we're going to apply the limits and the limits are a and 1 and we're going to be saying that this is equal to 2 fifth all right so where do we go from here? We substitute a, we have then ln a, okay, minus 1 over a, minus ln 1, which is 0, minus 1 over 1. It's going to give us 2 over 5, all right? And uh, therefore, I have ln a minus 1 over a is equal to minus, minus becomes plus. You have two fifth, and if you send the plus one on the other side, it becomes minus one. So, what is two fifth minus one? Is two over five minus one is going to give you minus three over five. So, this is ln a minus one over a is equal to minus three over five. Right, so we can inverse this. We can say a over ln a minus 1 is equal to minus 5 over 3. And if I do send this on the other side, it's going to become a is equal to minus 5 over 3 times ln a minus 1. And if you have uh, minus minus becomes plus, did I mess up somewhere here? Ln A, so Ln A minus 1 plus minus minus, okay, minus A minus minus becomes plus. 
All right, so plus one goes in the result becomes minus one minus a. Mm, I'm just checking out if uh, everything is all right here, because uh, it seems to me that uh, something is not quite right. Mm, where was it? Oh yeah. Oh sorry, this was minus. Should have been minus everywhere. Okay, and we have minus. Right. So therefore, I have a is equal to minus 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 becomes plus. So I got 5 over 3 into 1 plus L and E. Here we are for the first part, and that has been shown. Okay, now for the second part. We need to use the iterate, iteration uh, formula based on the equation for the second part that A is equal to 5 over 3 times 1 plus and, a. and the initial value x is going to be, or let's say a is going to be initial value mm, 4. Right, so I'm going to say a is equal to 5 over 3 into 1 plus ln 4. How much that's going to give us? So I've got um, ln 4, okay, right, plus 1. Okay, divided by 3 times 5, 3.9772, 3.9772, and I got A is equal to 5 over 3 into 1 plus ln 3.9772, I'm going to see how much that's going to give us. Okay, so ln 3.9772, okay, plus 1 divided by 3 times 5, 3.9676, 3.9676, and I've got a is equal to 5 over 3 times 1 plus ln 3.9676, and for this one, ln 3.9676 plus 1, okay, divided by 3 times 5, 3.96, 3.9636 Then I got um, A is equal to 5 over 3 into 1 plus ln 3.9636 Okay, so ln 3.9636 Right, plus 1 divided by 3 times 5 3.9619 3.9619 now what we, what can we see what can we observe is that that this is uh, converging to one value 3.96 3.96 3.96 i think with these four iterations it would be quite sufficient to say that a would be then approximately 3.96 to two decimal places as required by the question okay so here we are for this question i hope you've enjoyed it